What did you do? I know. No, no, shit. My new ultra ego form kind of changed my opinion. What's good, ladies and gentlemen, the SFJ Nation? It's me, SFJ, and I'm here. My album, Village Boys, drop. You know what I mean? Guess who's Badak, by the way? Link's in the description for Village Boy. SSJ 9K dropped a free uh, a battle <coughs> that I just reacted to. Make sure y'all go check that out. And now he dropped Vegeta Gets Hairline Fixed. I don't know. We know Vegeta's had a crazy hairline for the whole. You know what I mean? Like, that widow's peak is bananas. You feel me? That widow's peak is uncalled for. You feel me? So let's see what SSJ 9K did to my man's hairline. You feel me? Vegeta's hairline is like nothing you've ever seen. And you know what else is like nothing you've ever seen? Today's sponsor. This light is a pop fantasy RPG with striking 3D visuals and outstanding characters. Go on a few. You niggas. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie to you. I respect how you slid that in there, no freaky. I respect how you, I respect how you set him up. You had set him up, you had set him up like, yeah, this is Vegeta finna be banging. And then you slid right into the ad. Get your money, playboy. Go monsters. This light is real. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and skip it cause you know, it ain't pay me, man. But you know, I'm gonna skip that right there. Respectable. Yeah, you know I mean, God. And this a hell of an ad, bruh, bruh. Be helping support the channel. I know they, I know they broke you off different. For that, I know they broke you off spectacular, SSJ. What? Come on at me. Come on. How long? Give him a little, you know what I mean? Minute 17, whatever. God, right, Prince Vegeta, that's Prince Vegeta. Oh, they got, they got uh, the actual Prince Vegeta. Well, not I. There's a channel called Prince Vegeta, and he does the most spot on Vegeta voice, so. Vegeta, what's good, bruh? Welcome to my office. Wait. Froku. What did you do? I know. You don't know shit. My new ultra ego form kind of changed my opinion. <laughs> in case y'all didn't know, in case for some reason you've been under a rock and you claim to be a Dragon Ball Z fan, but you're not really. Not. Go, uh, Vegeta to unlock the new uh, stage. Evolution, transformation. Uh, long story short, he loses his eyebrows. Okay? If you didn't know, the internet went wild. He looked like he finally hit SS3, but it wasn't, you know, obviously that. You know. My new ultra ego form kind of changed my appearance. Kinda? Bruh. Your eyebrows have vanished. Yuck. Your hairline was already busted. Okay. And now you. By the way, I'm sorry. I hate the name Ultra Ego. I hate it. Ultra Instinct is cool. Ultra Ego is really stupid. I'm I'm sorry. And it almost makes in retrospect to me Ultra Instinct seem corny now cuz it's like wait. You call it Ultra Instinct cuz it was Goku but when Vegeta gets it's called Ultra e or doesn't get it that's not the same thing but Vegeta's next transformation is going to be called Ultra Ego. It's a little too on the nose. It's a little too. Why not just call it uh, 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 I'm the mean one and then Goku's transformation called I'm the nice one. Like, come on, my nigga. Like, that's a little on the nose. Like, we get it. And another thing, too, like, it kind of, in a way, Vegeta has grown. From having ultra ego, from being ego based, like a reduction of his character, like you cannot call somebody ultra. I mean, the transformation shouldn't be called ultra ego after the boo sacrifice. Like, come on, bro. He he grew up past that, but you bring your troll I get like it. We need more seasons, so. And I'm supposed to be able to fix this shit. You are out. Sorry for the rant. I have to do it. Because it causes me physical pain to look at. I you. just don't see the point of hitting the desk. Cause nigga, this is my desk. I don't tell you what to do with your raggedy ass hairline, so don't tell me what to do with my desk, or we will have a problem. Can you fix it or not? Got <laughs> you, bro. In order to do the procedure, we gotta take care of other places. My nigga Froku on the on the job. Oh, 
him. I'm for some for some rhyme or riddle. There's something about the uncanny valley that's just activating in this nigga. I don't know why, but Jiren, you can't put hair on Jiren and make him black because he looks too much like an actual nigga. They got a nigga Chris Brown. Nigga look like nigga look like a lot of people. Nigga look like the grown up version of the nigga from uh the holes, the nigga on uh, 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 zero. Nigga look like a lot of people, bruh. I didn't know when you threw a little uh, brush top fade on Jiren, he all of a sudden started looking like a lot of niggas. <laughs> hey, look like a lot of people. Okay, my bad. Oh, damn. Yeah, Black bastard. Hey. Yeah, that was out of line. Way out of line. I'm so sorry. This would never happen if I were gray. Wait. <laughs> What are you saying? Respect my black excellence! God, respect it. I'm so glad you're here, Vegeta. What the fuck? Vegeta! You look flying. Nigga, can't do singing the Vegeta thing. Vegeta got a hard ass theme. Vegeta always had a little hard ass theme. Swear to God, though. You look fly as shit. And he got the little bang going down. <laughs> all right, all right. Cut the she shit out. So what if he has a hairline now? You act like women are throwing panties at him or something. Take my panties. <laughs> You call for it. Why Vegeta look, and this is funny because it's literally Vegeta's character model. Only they threw a hairline on him and gave him one big ass bang. Why he look like a whole different character now? I guess I don't know. I think those are Goku's eyes though. I don't think those are Vegeta's eyes. But why, it makes you realize in anime how important the hair is of the character. Because the face is lightweight. Just be kind of like different variations of certain, like let's say if it was a character creation board. There ain't a lot of different eyes, eyebrows, and mouths and noses to choose from in anime. The variations really come in the hair and what they're wearing. Because this nigga look like a whole different nigga now. Stop hating on him, Jerron. I am not Jerron. I could care less about his hairline or how fly he's become. You are still no match for Jerron the Black. His ears look, I, I don't know, now that they're that color, now it just looks like they should be blurred out. <laughs> ah! No, this just looks gross. No freaky. Get it off my screen. Uh-uh, he gonna sing on you, nigga. This nigga's power is increasing. This nigga here. Yo. They, they just messed up making them black. Some char some characters you can make the you know the skin palette swap swap, and it'll work fine. Something about Jiren being black is so unsettling, nigga. And then now when you took that off, it's just like ugh, ugh. It's like the uncanny that is like creepy now. Like ooh, Jiren has to be like a weird. Off gray, off purple, nigga, like. You were hating on Vegeta, and this whole time you're wearing a wig! What's the name of the Dr. Vegeta? Nigga, Tori Lane. Ain't this some shit? Don't you worry, <laughs> Mr. Jerron. Us brothers gotta stick together, you know what I'm saying? My nigga. Now don't move! Boy. Okay, so in this universe, Goku and Froku exist. Okay, alright. We need a Gro Goku Froku battle then. I don't know why you haven't done that. SSJ 9K, but we need a Goku Froku battle, bro. But we now that we know that in this universe there are two different people, 
What's up? Put Goku Foku on there. What are we, what we really talking about? If you move, I can cut your head off. You could ward me. No way. Go, go. Go, go. I'm not moving. Thanks for watching it the light. I'm jamming though, I ain't gonna lie. Speaking of that, Village Boy Apparel. Shout out to everybody who supported the uh, Goku Vegeta merch. But Village Boy Apparel is the next movement. Stay still, stay right there. We got big things going. Big things. Stay tuned.